these are more business moves um than somewhere for me to actually live and something for me to actually have um for my legacy and for my family for family property right so i'm like okay no problem um i'm gonna stay in my trailer uh keep it in my warehouse live in there get me some more land and let my tenants pay off these houses that me and my business partners have and it's all good so everything going like that um ended up moving to north carolina um finding some more land in 2020 with some other business partners and boom i took off again but this time i'm like i'm not selling my land i'm not selling my land and i'm gonna buy more land so from 20 from august 2020 till the till about the middle of from about august 2020 to about august 2022 I basically brought a property every month, every two months. I basically brought a property every month, every two months. Well, land, specifically land, right? Through the method that I do. Owner finance and rent to own put down about 50 to $500 down. Or in my case, because I built a rapport with sellers, zero down. And most of my properties, guys, I'm only paying $50 a month. Like 12, 15 of my properties, I'm only paying $50 a month. My other properties are like two, three, four, five hundred dollars $500 a month. Okay. And also I have business partners. I have business partners. So, but that's a whole nother, um, video at the end of the day guys i learn you always have bills you will always have bills you will always pretty much be in debt you'll always have an emergency to pop up that's gonna put you in debt you might come into a lot of money and you have to go pay off this debt and you have to go buy a new truck a new car, a new place to live, new clothes, new shoes. Like every year, people get their income tax money and they don't have a choice. They have to go buy a new car because their car done broke. They got to go buy new clothes because the clothes, you, your kids, your, I mean, your offsprings need new clothes. You need new furniture. It happens every year. But I'm trying to tell you, even though you got all this going on, you have to put some money aside, put it into some land because you will always have to fix your car. You will always have car trouble. You will always have to buy new clothes. You will always have to buy new furniture. You will always have to buy a new phone. Every year you got to buy a new phone. You will always have to move. You will always be kicked out of your place or you have to move. You will always be starting over relationships. These things will always happen. But you have to put something up somewhere that no matter what's going on in your life, you have some type of solitude. You have somewhere that you could call your own. Something that's never going anywhere. Your relationship will break up. You're going to lose that car. You're going to lose that house. You're going to lose that apartment. You're going to lose that truck. You're going to lose those clothes. You're going to lose those shoes. You're going to lose that cell phone. You're going to lose that TV. It comes and goes. But you need one, two, three pieces of land. Not the house, the land. That you can always go to that's yours. It ain't going nowhere. It's going to stay in the family. Just having that peace of mind in your head gives you confidence. It gives you confidence to conquer the world because that's how you conquer the world. 